It's now before the hour. People in the Twin Cities are getting <laughs> pumped up, geared up. The shout of play ball will be heard in the Metrodome tonight. Yes, the Western Division leading Minnesota Twins take to the field. It is opening night. And Steve Carroll's down there, too. He is at the Metrodome at home plate. Whoa. And he joins us live. Good morning there, Al. Morning. Good morning. Good morning, John and Marty. Just getting rid of some of the uh, pregame jitters I have uh, at this hour of the morning. It is true. It is the Twins home open. The Twins are home this morning after a, a pretty successful road trip. They checked in the Twin Cities uh, late last night. And after almost two months on the road, they'll be back at the Dome tonight for the home opener against Seattle. And there seems to be a lot of optimism after winning the, the last two out of their three away games. Our pitching is going to be as good as our defense, and uh, guys played outstanding in Oakland, and if we can continue it, I think uh, we're going to have a rewarding year. It's certainly a lot more fun having a home opener uh, where you've got 50-plus thousand yelling for you as opposed to going on the road, and uh, we opened up with 24 people that wanted to beat us very badly and 47,000 that hated us. Now, after the Twins get home, the work is just beginning for some people. Now, this has been going on ever since the Twins played their first home game back in 1961. Carolyn Marinin leads a team report beginning with the reading of the locker room. The Twins arrived in the Twin Cities late last night. So did their equipment. All of it was carted off to the dome. Time to unload. Once it was all stacked, it was off to its destination through the dome tunnels. Inside the club room and part of the job accomplished. Now for the second half. Unpacking every bag, hanging up every uniform and polishing shoes. Everything has to be just right for the Twins tonight. Club room manager Jim Wiesner has been with Back the team the for 26 shelf, right? years and he makes yeah, sure the job gets done. Uh, I take pride in my locker room and uh, I didn't just start last, last year, this is my 26th year. so. I've been doing it for a while. Crew here, as you can see, they, they do the blunt of the work. I just tell them what to do, I guess you'd say, but got to stay on top of them. I know I'm all set for the 1986 home opener. Steve Carroll has more on the first home opener in 1961. It was 25 years ago when Major League Baseball made its debut in Minnesota. The Twin Cities joined together to await the famous cry of play ball. Metropolitan Stadium was the home of the Twins then, and it was a sellout as fans from all over poured into the stadium to watch the history-making affair. Among the celebrities on hand for the opener, baseball commissioner Ford Frick and American League president Joe Cronin and his wife. The players lined up for the flag-raising ceremony and the national anthem played by the University of Minnesota marching band. Then Governor Elmer Anderson tossed out the first pitch, and the 1961 Twins took the field. Among the stars in the lineup that day, Harmon Killebrew, Bob Allison, and Earl Batty, just to name a few. Washington ruined the party, though, beating the Twins 5-3 in the first Major League Baseball game played in the Twin Cities. Now, there was no joy in Twinsville that day, but hopefully things will go a little bit better tonight at the Metrodome. We'll be back uh, a little bit later with more on the game and the rest of sports. John, Marty? Okay, thanks okay, so much, thanks, Steve. Steve. Mm -hmm. We are primed and waiting. Yes. <laughs> and tomorrow, so make sure you get to one of the TV 11 health fairs. That's it for Daybook. Let's check in with Steve Carroll. Steve, what's coming up? Okay, uh, let's get John and Marty cooking in the bullpen, okay? <laughs> okay. Uh, it's baseball time here at the Metrodome. Twins in Seattle, game time at 7.30. Sally, don't feel bad. You're already in the game, so you don't need to warm up. But let's check in with the weather forecast right now. Sally? <laughs> I'll go for that not warming up. Today will warm up, though, very nicely under sunshine. High temperature 66 degrees, and if you're headed to the dome later on tonight, you'll just need a light jacket. Temperatures at that time will be in the low 60s. Oh, I got the bug. Mm. Well, having a hat doesn't hurt either, does it? Do I look as silly as you look? Yes. <laughs> Spring is here. Baseball about to begin. Yes, you know that when the Twins are here. But our overnight editor, Kashmir Arani, has put together something that shows that old man winter is gone. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye. <laughs>